Valeria has been playing the bandura since childhood. She devotes several hours a day to master her skills. It is a very complicated instrument in all terms. The sound of extraction, free play, and it is necessary to work properly and learn from the beginning, so it is very difficult to learn, but then it sounds very nice. Ivan plays the electric bandura. It differs from the original one. It is louder. An acoustic bandura player has a limit on the number of people, three meters away, and he is not heard. An electric instrument enhances the effectiveness of the musician. The main task of the festival is to dispel the myth that the bandura is an outdated, uninteresting instrument. There is a stereotype that the bandura is not progressive. However, this is a progressive, cool instrument. It is already electroacoustic. And there is also a stereotype that the bandura is a folk instrument, as it is called. But this one was created in the 1960s. That is, it is a modern instrument. In order to popularize playing the bandura, the festival organizers have created a mobile application. It is possible to play six Ukrainian instruments there. Over two years, the application has been downloaded for free by over 100,000 people. For example, I can play all strings. There is even a setting. You can take a different system, such as the Lydian, for instance. And as we then play it, one can also take shorts. The festival is attended by not only Ukrainian, but foreign musicians as well. David came from Washington, D.C. He has Ukrainian roots and learned about the bandura from his father. I love bandura music. I have two banduras of my own, and I know many banduristas. In America, close to where I used to live, we had bandura camp. The Capella Bandurista hosted a bandura camp where they taught bandura every summer. And I used to work at the camp in the kitchen to help cook. So I, I, I've, been, I, I've known the, about the bandura ever since I was a young boy. I used to dream about singing with the Capella Bandurist. So. The yearly Bandura festival is the only one of a kind in Ukraine. And this festival is already the fifth one. Reported by Vadim Kramer and Yulia Bil, UATV News.